Might lit up. They're a top predator. So like any of the other large top predators like wolves, uh, sharks, they're gonna be important in controlling numbers of other populations. Yeah, you, you, you use fish for everything. Garfish is what you normally use. Garfish is what I'm going for, yeah. Okay. A lot of populations have seen dramatic declines in the last few decades, and what we're trying to do is increase our ability to produce fish for restocking purposes. Good morning and welcome to Wet Work. I'm your host, Alex Ablaw, and keeping up with today's tradition, we're going to try to get wet again. I'm here today with Dr. Elise Farrar from Nickel State University. And Mr. Ricky Verrett. Now, Mr. Ricky, you're a commercial fisherman, right? Uh -huh. Okay, so what are we going to be doing today? Oh, uh, we'll go out there and run some line, you know, hope we catch some fish, and uh, come back to the dock and clean them. Okay, so now, Dr. Elise, we, you do research on garfish, right? Right. Okay, so what are you going to be doing on the research aspect today? What well, are we gonna we'll be get at? our samples from Ricky, and he's actually invaluable with our research program because we, he is the one that catches the fish. He's much more efficient at it than we are. All right, well, let's get to it. So besides, is it just garfish we're going to be fishing for today? Or? I go out there and normally catch garfish, but I catch other things, stinger riggers, redfish, sharks, you know. Sometimes. So, yeah, you, you, you use fish for everything, but garfish is what you normally garfish catch? Garfish is what I'm going for, yeah. Okay. Now what's the, what's the, the biggest fish you've ever, you've ever caught? Oh, I have one of those seven foot, over seven foot. Over oh, seven, how much, what was it, it was, uh, it was one of the garfish, right? Yeah. How much did it weigh? Oh, I don't know, it's pretty, you know, just one of them dressed like an 80 pound dress. Oh. Just, sometimes they got like 30 some pounds of the eggs. So you set some uh, some buoy traps for the fish to go to, or is just it how do you fish one? Some jugs. You got thighs, a hook, and a bait, and just throw the line out. And the garfish, don't they have like their? They eat other fish, right? Yeah. They, they, don't they have like teeth and stuff? Oh you yeah. You got bit by it? Oh yeah, I got bit by a few times. Too many times. Yeah. Look, like I got all my fingers and stuff. We haven't caught any gar yet, Mr. Ricky. I think it's a suspense, you know? Now the sea cat. About the same size, too. Now you got something to fight with, huh? I'll put him in the boat. Alright. You are a one camera shot fish. Golly. Well, we caught something, huh? Yeah. Not the elusive garfish. The sharks aggravate. Oh yeah, because you, know, you can't hardly really catch garfish like you want, because they're always you know, biting on your line. Well, we're definitely going to have a garfish right there, huh? I think so. You know. This is it. You think this is it? Yeah. I smell something. Man, look at the big, how big it is. Man, that thing is huge. Check it out. How much do you think it weighs? Now that he was dressed off at 20, close to 25 pounds. Hello. <laughs> Man, look at that. They eat pretty much everything else in here. Mm-hmm. Holy. Now, how big would you call that? Small, medium? Uh, medium size. Medium size. Yeah. This is really cool though. I've like never gotten to do anything like this before. Right, and we only caught one today, huh? Yeah, not, not too good. All right, so sometimes, sometimes Mother Nature wins, right? Oh yeah. Okay, did Mother, I know you went fishing yesterday. Did Mother Nature win yesterday? Oh no. Uh, no, it lost? I whipped now, it. How many you caught? 25 yesterday. 25, yeah. man, that's a lot. So we're gonna clean it today, right? Yeah. Mm -hmm. All right, so what do we gotta do? All right, well we gotta make sure it's in this place, you know, and stick a screwdriver and just take the key knife and just Pull this off, you know. Yeah, just. All right, just like this. Yeah. There you go. Oh, that ain't good, is it? Nah, not really. Just like this. Yeah. How am I doing? Uh, 
But first time, all right. All right. Okay. Look at this side. Just haul it. Don't try this at home. <laughs> I got the head off. 10, 12. I got the foot. It's pretty cool. Wait, there's a piece missing right there. You got it. Somebody comes pick them up yeah. right here. Thank you so much for allowing us to come with you. No problem teaching us all the odds and ends of commercial fishing and all that you put into it, all the effort, all the skill and expertise that's needed in it. I know we, we caught one garfish today, brought it back, attempted to clean it, you know. I thought this was wet work, I didn't think it was gut work. But that was, it was pretty cool, you know, I, had a, I had a great time, learned a lot. So now I think maybe we can go and try to look into a little bit more of the research aspect of what goes into gar fishing. But until then, keep it wet. <laughs>